Le'Veon Bell. That's me. Are you scared of heights? Depends on what high heights we're talking about. We're talking about if I'm on a bridge or if I'm in an airplane, jumping out of it. Yeah. What about if we went to an amusement park? Like, is there a ride you'd be scared to get on? Oh, yeah, I ain't fucking with the rides. So you don't ride everything? No. The ground rules early. When we say ride yeah. everything, it's kind of like the opposite of that. I'm like, ride nothing. Ride nothing. You know, keep it that way. Yeah, that's, <laughs> that's good. That's good. Why do you think nobody likes the end pieces of bread? Bro, I don't know for real. That's a good <laughs> question. Look at that. The reason why I, I can tell you why I don't fuck with it. Because it's on the outside, bro. It's like, okay, I feel like I'm looking at this as y'all protection. You protecting this side of my bread loaf and you protecting this side of my bread loaf. Everything in the middle, edible. Everything on the outside is like an orange. You don't eat the orange peel, do you? Ah. You only eat the inside of it. You don't eat the outside of banana. You eat the inside of it. It just look weird. That's why I don't eat it. No, it, it do look weird. Yeah. Wait, like, why did I make it look different than all the other, <laughs> other pieces, too? That, that is right. Yeah. It's like it's one-sided. <laughs> it's like a one-faced loaf. It definitely is. Can't crazy. get my nigga two faces. <laughs> <laughs> my dad would always say, "My house, my rules." Mm. But we live in an apartment. <laughs> you a vegetarian? Vegan. What's the difference? Pause is neither one of them eat meat, but vegetarian they still eat uh like dairy products. Vegan don't. Vegan no dairy no meat. Extreme. Pause. <laughs> Are you part of the Pause Patrol? I've been low key been made part of it because I low key went viral for a little moment. Yeah. For not pausing. I'm not part of Pause Patrol, so. All right, cool, cool. Yeah. Yeah. Do you enjoy playing video games? Love video games. If you play Smash Bros. Don't you bring us Smash Bros. <laughs> Too late. Mega Man. <laughs> what about the original? He's not in the original. My first character was Fox. Fox and Cloud. Ah. Uh, my next question was going to be, is there a character that annoys you that people pick a lot? For me, it would have been Fox because that's like the. Damn, yeah. Fox is kind of hard to play. I feel uh, like the, the starter person that you pick is Fox. You just. And then yeah. You, ah, that's my guy. Fox was my guy when I first started. Then three games later, they brought Mega Man and it Mega changed Man. everything. And if anybody think they can see me with my Mega Man, <laughs> bruh, please. Anybody. Okay. Pro, semi-pro, <laughs> colleague, collegiate, it don't matter. All right. Le'Veon, is it true you help people out when you can? I do. My boy Ryan been selling buttercups out of his pocket for the last 17 years. And I was wondering if you'd like to help out and be his first customer. I'll take it. Yeah. A purchase, sir. How much that cost? Fifty-two dollars a pop. Fifty-two dollars a pop? Damn, that boy waxing. <laughs> he said I'll give you a discount, so I can slide to you about fifty dollars. What about the the discount for fifty two cents? What's up? Yeah, I was gonna talk to you about that. What's up? Hey. <laughs> it's been seventeen years, man. Yeah. Seventeen years too long. Right, it is. <laughs> would you agree that you have to be careful with who you listen to? Yes, I would agree. Who told you to start rapping? <laughs> Nobody told me to start. Nobody told me to start. A lot of people told me to stop. A lot of people told me to stop. That's why you said be careful who you listen to. A lot of people told me to stop. Nobody told me to start. Okay. All right. Yep. Do you wash your drawers in the shower? No. You like saving money? I like saving my money. I don't like washing my drawers in the shower. Touche. <laughs> Personal preference. <laughs> in a song, you said, play my music, play my tunes. I got pools. I got juice. Go bananas. <laughs> go bad boom. Make it boom. Make it boom. Make it boom. Make that shit boom. I got bands. I you got ever think about signing the Could Have Been Records with Juicy? <laughs> no, I never thought about it. Mm. Hey, I'm tapped in on his label, though. Hey. With his label, he got some things going. Yeah, it could be a good match. Man. I see, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. I see he got something going over there. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Could have been. Like, wow. Hey, Juicy, if you signing. Make it boom. Make it boom. Mm. Make it boom. Make it rain. <laughs> hey, man, would you say you're a stealer for life? Yep. How often do you steal? Every day. Oh, I'll put them right there. I thought you took the Reese's from me. I was like, <laughs> Every day. <laughs> for real? Stealing hearts. Ah. Taking names. Every day. Stealing everything. <laughs> <laughs> Le'Veon, it said that all great running backs remember every fumble. Is that true? Yeah, just about. Yeah, but I can remember damn near every fumble, yeah. So out of your 10 career fumbles, where would you rank the holdout? <laughs> holdout, out of my 10 or where I rank it, that's probably my, my not as bad fumble. Mm. 
Because the fumbles on the field is way worse. <laughs> Debatable. Bro, have you ever fumbled? <laughs> huh? Have you ever fumbled the ball on the field? With millions of people watching you? Another team got the ball? And you like watching it. It's like slow-mo too. So it's like you can feel the ball leave your arm. Yeah. And it's like, damn, I'm getting tackled. So guy on my legs, I'm seeing the ball just bloop, bloop, bloop. But, but it's slow-mo. I see it. Nobody yeah. else even know the ball out. Nobody else even see the ball out. But I see it. And I can't get to it. That is the worst feeling. More than anything. Do you hear what I'm saying? You did say you smoked before the games, right? You think that explanation has something to do with it? No. Actually, no. Yeah, I guess if you never was on the field, you probably wouldn't. I was on the field. Oh, so, so yeah, you probably know then. You hey, know. I wasn't a running back. What'd you play? Receiver? No. DB? Yeah. I, I knew one of the other yeah. DB receivers. Yeah. I can see it. I can see yeah. it. So, DB, you definitely want from when you picking shit off? Before the season, I was picking everything off and all the scrimmages preseason games. Oh, he's a <laughs> practice superstar. No, 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 he's no. practice not superstar. Practice. Not practice, not practice, not practice. I swear, I swear, not practice. What was it? Preseason, we was going against it, but uh, it didn't count. Like Oh, okay, so like scrimmages. Yeah. Practice superstar. Uh, practice superstar. Butterfingers. I mean, that's why I was a receiver, you know? That's what <laughs> I was doing my job. It counts as a SWAT. Right. Uh, when it comes to football, do you miss it? Yeah. Yeah? At times. It's definitely times. It's definitely times where I'm like, damn, I don't. But yeah, it's definitely times I miss playing for sure. Do you see any similarity between scoring touchdowns and getting knocked out? <laughs> what? Adrian Peterson? <laughs> I probably should ask him then. I'm, I'm yeah, 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 you're right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did you ever apologize? Uh, I wouldn't say I apologize. Can, can no. we apologize? Sorry, AP. AP, I'm, my fault, bro. Yeah, I, you didn't, but you know, we went viral. For the better cause. Hey, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Do you ever get frustrated when you sit back and you think, in football, you was him. Now in transition to music and boxing, you kind of got to start over on ground level. I wouldn't say frustrated. I think it's more of a a challenge. I just take on of a challenge, another challenge. So it's like, oh. damn, in football, I made it to this level. Mm -hmm. I ain't start there though. Started down here. Shit. Ooh. Started in low league. Had to go up there. I knew where I wanted to go. Yeah. Same thing with music. It's like shit. I ain't gonna start here being Drake. Right when I pick up a mic. If I want to get there, I got to work there. What have you found is the biggest challenge so far in the transition? I mean, I'm starting to get a grasp of it now, but my biggest challenge was, like, managing my schedule. Because I think literally some, from from high school all the way to college, NFL, it's a schedule. It's like, oh, we got this, this, yeah. that, this, yeah. that, that. Then it's like when all that's done, it's like now I wake up, it's like I ain't got nothing on the schedule. It's just damn, I do whatever I want. You know what I'm saying? What I'm going to do. Like, you know what I'm saying? So I think that was like my biggest transition. But it's like now, it's like, I didn't got a little hang of, you know what I'm saying? I'm into the music. I'm doing gaming. Like we talked about Mega Man and stuff, obviously boxing and stuff. Yeah. Like I'm working out all the time. So it's always something I'm waking up and doing, like, and finding some type of niche to get better. In my head, I could picture someone like questioning you and be like, what? Check my resume. But then all football highlights come up. I would think that'd be the biggest challenge. Right. <laughs> 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 Can we see a jab? Can we Here's your ah. Hey, hey, it's not ah. hit. Ah. Hey, don't play. I, oh, I, I don't take, take it easy. Take, take it easy. Take it easy. Take it easy. Don't get me started. Don't throw the hook. All that. It's y'all all over the mic. I ain't my, touching the mic, though. Just my, my cardio ain't there, man. Relax. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> all over the mic. Out of these two scenarios, tell me which one is more realistic to happen next. You knocking out Jake Paul? Me knocking out Jake Paul. Oh. I don't even hear you. Hear the second. The second one can be, damn, or you walking outside. What's more realistic? You knocking out Jake Paul or someone saying, yo, put that levy on on? What's more realistic? Me knocking out Jake Paul. To me? Yeah. Yeah, that. Yep. That. Yep. Now, ask me in about a year. Because I'll probably already knocked him out. And I think. <laughs> Yeah, then I think the other one was like, damn, what's more realistic? <laughs> Pulling our lady on bail. By that time, that motherfucking dude's gonna be booming. We're making it boom right now. So that's <sighs> making it boom. Slowly, slowly, but slowly. It's growing, it's growing, it's growing. Yes, sir. That's how we do it. Le'Veon, I'm assuming you know a couple Larrys. A couple of Larrys. You no, know, a couple yeah. people named Larry? Do any of them spell their name with two L's? No. Oh, not that I know of. It's a guy named Larry. Been looking for him for a year and a half now. You owe me money, Larry. Man. Larry. You wanna <laughs> Larry. Just look out if you see somebody that spelled their name with two L's. Oh, yeah, yeah, for sure. Appreciate you. I never knew a Larry spelled with two L's, though. It's unique good. case. Damn, yeah, that's really unique. His parents wanted him different. Like, you know, why does food taste better when it's free? Because it's free. That shit <laughs> free. You ain't got to pay for it. That shit tastes good, don't it? <laughs> hey, it tastes so good when you ain't got to pay for it, boy. <laughs> Man. Or it's like, damn, I ain't got to worry about putting it all away. Like, I ain't got to worry about eating it. Like, mm. people like wasting food when it ain't paid for. When you, when you don't got to pay for it, it's crazy. But, yeah. 
because you don't got to pay for it. So yeah. it's not coming out your pocket. So it's like, damn, I get to eat at wherever for free. Expectation is way lower when it's free, right? Way lower. Like, yo, damn, way lower. Like, you can't mess up when it's free because I ain't pay for it. <laughs> I'm going to make it work. I'm going to make it work. <laughs> it's free. So it should taste good to me. I'm with you. I'm no with complaints. You. What do you think is the best snack to sneak into the theaters? Ooh. Damn, this is a good one. Like for me, I'll be sneaking Oreos in. Oreos. They don't be having Oreos at the movies. Oh, they don't? Nah. Oh. They, they, AMC, y'all need to get that together. Oreos. They have Twizzlers. They be having like candy. They be having like popcorn, obviously. I get popcorn. They don't have Oreos. <laughs> <laughs> they don't have Oreos. They don't have Oreos at the movies, bro. Wow. Like, yeah, think about that. It's like <laughs> blowing your mind how you don't got Oreos. Yeah. I... Wow. Yeah, okay. They, they, they don't got Oreos. I sneak Oreos in. I'm sneaking Oreos in the movie theaters. Sure. It's kind of crazy that you even say sneak, sneak into the movie theaters. So you sneaking stuff to the movie theaters. Well, you said you steal all the time, so. They ain't stealing. But I'm saying, it, it ain't worse than that. <laughs> <laughs> right, you're right, though. I'm saying, yeah, it ain't worse than that. Right now, I'm going to say three statements that I think most people agree with. And after each one, if you agree with it, say I agree. If you don't, say what you will. All right? Okay. There's no Kool-Aid without sugar. Agree. People who stink are slightly more tolerable in the winter than in the summer. I can't agree with that. Things don't smell a little better when it's cold out. When it's hot out, it's a little magnified. You're like, God. I feel like I'm still going to smell it if it's cold. Yeah, no. I said slightly more tolerable. I, uh, I guess when you say slightly more tolerable, that phrase, I guess I'll go with that. I agree. Okay. Neither one of them are really tolerable because I'm saying, like, if they both was live with me, <laughs> I'm not tolerating anyone. <laughs> Just man, like, you know, you because you, you, I guess the sweat and it's like yeah. it's hot. Yeah, I mean, I you guess, you're yeah. going to practice. I'm sure not everybody smell good. So in the yeah, cold, but even even cold, the yeah. cold games you go in the locker room, it be cold, it be stinky too. I, I ain't even talking about in the locker room because yeah, that's like a confined space. Maybe on the field, or you don't smell it as bad when it's cold out. You like, just ain't think about because it it's cold. That's what I'm saying. It's like, <laughs> what's <laughs> yeah, but it's more top. Oh, yeah, you right, you right. The, I, I agree. The last thing is oh shit, cantaloupe is a Le'Veon Bell of fruits. Nah. Cantaloupe is my favorite fruit, so I... I you, nah, you, I don't agree with that. Cantaloupe top two? And it's not two? Also, cantaloupe is your favorite. That's what you mean by Le'Veon Bell? Cantaloupe is my favorite fruit. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I'm cantaloupe, yeah, for sure. Thank you. Yeah. I thought you mean, like, what fruit got the juice? Or they got, like, more juice than, like, grapes, maybe. I don't ever hear cantaloupe juice. You want some cantaloupe juice, man? I, I, I fuck with cantaloupe, though. Don't get me wrong, cantaloupe is one of my favorite... Oh, it is? Yeah, for sure. I fuck with cantaloupe. <laughs> yeah, I fuck with cantaloupe. <laughs> People sleep on cantaloupe. You know what? Somebody said something to me and it hurt my feelings. What? He said on a fruit platter. Cantaloupe is the last thing you eat me? Oh, yeah, that's crazy. Not for me. Yeah. For me, it's berries. Berries? The blueberries. I never even noticed blueberries on a fruit platter. I might eat the I mean, I'll eat a blueberry. If I'm hungry, I gotta be hungry. Cantaloupe? That's not last. Cantaloupe, Loki might be. It depends on what's on there. If, if it's grapes on there, grapes would be first, and it'd probably be pineapple than cantaloupe. Damn, third? I'll take it third. Kelly was fire though. Was I, I can't yeah. pick it over grapes and pineapple though. You is third though, top three. I'm yeah. giving top three behind grapes and pineapple. Grapes, no question. Grapes is fire. <laughs> the yeah, purple I, grapes though, not the green ones. Seedless. The grapes is great. It's just the seed ones. You got to work a little harder. You can eat them too if you want. I mean, ain't yeah, I don't do that. No. I just kind of bite it, yeah. bite around it. Wow. Yeah, you right. Spit a little, out. Little, little more work. Yeah. It's a little work. Yeah. So it's like eating a sunflower seed. Technically, it's the want. opposite of a sunflower seed. Yeah, yeah, yeah it is opposite. You're right because you eat the inside of a sunflower seed. This the outside of a grape. Yeah. God damn. We did something. We did. We thinking over here. Voila! God damn. <laughs> he said, no, it's technically the opposite. Yeah. Nah, I'm blown away. Yeah, I'm I like know. thinking about like, damn. Can grape, cantaloupe. You know sunflower what? seeds. Nah, I ain't throwing sunflower seeds. Man. Oh, sunflower wait. Sunflower seeds cool. They just, they something to do. Well, now what are we talking about? Shit, I don't even remember. Sorry. <laughs> 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 so wait, 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 wait. I don't even talk about what does the grass ain't always greener mean to you today? The other side ain't always better. Mm. It ain't always what you think it is. So like, shit, I can't see over the fence. My grass green, but shit over there might be a little greener. But we don't know. Right. But damn, do I want to go over the fence? Do I want to go over the fence to see? One of those. Yeah, too giant. It's one of them wooden fences, though. It ain't the steel fence where you can see through that shit. Like, no, you oh. got to touch that grass. Yeah, and if you go over, it's yours now, right? Damn. It's your, your grass. Mm. Baby, on where can people follow you on social media? I got everything. Shit, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat. Really, Snapchat. Really, follow me on Snapchat for sure. L underscore Bell24. TikTok, Le'Veon Bell. YouTube, Le'Veon Bell. Music, Le'Veon Bell. You heard it. Go to Google, Le'Veon Bell. Everything gonna pop up for you, Le'Veon Bell. For the people in tune with you and for the people who may want to follow you now, 
You have any words for them? Make sure you tap in with your boy. Subscribe. Snapchat. Follow me on Instagram, Twitter. And obviously, I'm a lot of fun. Boxing. Football. I hoop, too. And for everybody that didn't know, we ain't talking about hooping today. But I hoop. Gaming. Rap. Sing. Dance. Same. But damn near, you name it. I, you name it. I, and if I can't do it, it probably shouldn't be done. You get what I'm trying to say? It's like one of those. Well, Le'Veon, I appreciate you. Thank you for coming to Kick Back with Kay. Kay, I appreciate you, bro. Thanks for kicking back with me. Let's <laughs> <laughs> fucking go. Subscribe. Shout out to my guy, Kay, for kicking it with Lay. That's my guy. We had a great kickback. Got to know me a little bit. Hopefully, you got to know K a little bit better, too. Hopefully, I got to pick up my mind about K a little bit, too. So, make sure you follow your boy. Follow your boy. We ain't going up from here. Rocket, blast off. Let's go. Go.